This is your John Wall Street Sports Business Minute. I'm Corey Leff. The NBA became the first U.S. pro sports league to sign an official sports betting partnership, having announced a deal with MGM Resorts International. The three-year deal, worth $25 million, gives the resort and gaming operator authorization to use league highlights, names, logos, and its direct data feed, and enables the company to market itself as the official gaming partner of the NBA and WNBA, but does not permit MGM to offer odds on screen during league games. So the key to this deal on the MGM side is the direct data feed, which will enable the company to provide an advanced in-game betting product. Well, live betting currently represents just a small fraction of all bets placed on league action, it's suspected that delays in third-party fees have hampered its potential. As for the NBA, they're finally going to receive compensation for their intellectual property, just not the 1% integrity fee they had originally sought. While it's far too early to project how much will be bet on league games, and ultimately the percentage 25 million equates to, the league must be ecstatic they were able to get a deal done without any federal statutes in place, because there really was no reason for a gaming company to cave to their demands. Of course, MGM made for an easy target in the league's quest to profit off of legalized sports betting. Why? They own the WNBA's aces, they've sponsored the NBA's summer league the last two years, and it's believed the company wants to place a team in the Las Vegas T-Mobile arena. In other words, they're motivated to work with the league. That's not the case though for the remainder of the players in the sports betting space who oppose fees of any sort and are now placed in a tough spot with the precedent set. Gaming companies will pay for access to official data. If sports business is your thing, Make sure to sign up for our free daily email newsletter at johnwallstreet.com.